Well, players, today we got confirmation of what we already was speculating and deep inside we already knew. Carly Russell lied. Oh, yes, 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 honey. She has admitted that it was all a hoax. I declare, honey. What a disgrace. Y'all go ahead and grab your tea and have a seat. Let's talk about it. So today, the Hoover Police Department held another press conference. Unfortunately, the district attorney wasn't there. I would really love to hear what they have to say about this. But he was wearing lavender today, honey, looking quite dapper, quite debonair, if I must say so myself. And he said that Carly Russell issued a statement through her attorney where she said that there was never a baby. There was never uh, a kidnapping of any kind. And that uh, it was all a hoax. I'll go ahead and take a listen and I'll be right back. There was no kidnapping on Thursday, July 9th, 13th, 2023. My client did not see a baby on the side of the road. My client did not leave the Hoover area when she was identified as a missing person. My client did not have any help in this incident, but this was a single act done by herself. My client was not with anyone or any hotel with anyone from the time she was missing. My client apologizes for her actions to this community, the volunteers who were searching for her, to the Hoover Police Department and other agencies as well, as to her friends and family. We ask for your prayers for Carly as she addresses her issues and attempts to move forward, understanding that she made a mistake in this matter. Carly again asks for your forgiveness and prayers. We have a meeting scheduled with Mr. Anthony to further discuss this case. We're currently in discussions with the Jefferson County District Attorney's Office in Bessemer about possible criminal charges related to this case, and we will announce those charges when and if they are filed. I declare, honey, what a disgrace. Well, she did apologize and say that she needs to deal with whatever she needs to deal with, and I'm going to keep it a stack with you, honey. You got to deal with a lot to come up with some stuff like that, because baby, that was elaborate as hell. Here's the kicker. The Hoover Police Department actually had a meeting set up with Carly. However, that was canceled, and then they ended up getting this statement. So he stated that they will be meeting with Carly's attorney tomorrow. Not sure if Carly will be there, if Carly will be giving a statement, or will she just be speaking through her attorney? But at the end of the day, it's above us now, honey. It's with the district attorney. So whatever the district attorney wants to do with this, that's what's going to happen. There's been a lot of speculation going online that this situation may stop uh, searches for black women or people of color in the future. And I'm going to go ahead and keep it a stack with your players. If this situation is the only reason that people have to use as an excuse to not look for black women, then, honey, they was looking for an excuse in the first place because white women do this type of thing all the time. So if y'all stop looking for black women just because one of us lied, then baby, you was just looking for an excuse in the first place. I want us to keep that same energy. I would never apologize for making the videos that I made about Carly Russell trying to locate her because at the end of the day, we thought sincerely that she was missing. Like my mom always said, honey, you don't do something uh, for somebody expecting something in, the, in return because when you do that, you didn't do it with a good heart in the first place. So when I put those videos out about Carly, I was really concerned for her. When I prayed for Carly, I was really praying for her to be returned safely. And actually, I got what I wanted. Now, it, it is hurtful and sad that she lied. And I'm hoping that there are no repercussions uh, uh, because of this on the black community because we did do what we had to do to find her. But at the end of the day, Baby, she lied. There ain't no way you could put this on the police department. She done admitted it. She lied. So, hey, it is what it is. Do with that as you will. But it's above us now. Whatever the district attorney wants to do with this, that's just what they gonna do. All right, players, put your thoughts in the comments. This is Double D Mother for the Black Accurate News.